The known facts about the honey badger, one of the most interesting animals in the world, are extremely surprising. The more you get to know these tiny creatures, the more interesting they become. We answer all your questions about what the honey badger eats, where it lives, where it gets its name from. The Latin name of the honey badger, which is from the weasel family, is Melivora capensis. The first reason why it got this name, which means something like cloaked honey eater, is that the white color on its back resembles a cloak. The second reason is that this creature really loves sweet things. There is a rumor that they steal honey hives by working together with a bird species called honeybird, and after the honey badger eats the bees, larvae and honey in the hive, the honeybird eats the rest. However, such a situation has not yet been observed. Still, the honey badger's love of sweets is a well-known fact enough to determine its name. It is known that skunks escape in case of possible danger by neutralizing their enemies by emitting a foul odor. It is a fact unknown to many people that the honey badger releases a stink bomb that is much stronger than the stench released by the skunk. The honey badger does not emit a scent. It instantly releases a very strong and effective scent bomb. This scent coming out of his anus is so effective that it remains effective for a long time where it is released. In the meantime, the honey badger can easily escape or has the opportunity to swallow its prey, stunned by the scent. The honey badger has long and strong claws. It is known that it creates a space for itself within minutes by digging the soil, tree trunks, termite nests, and even the concrete ground in Africa, Southwest Asia, and India where it generally lives. Digging is both fun and a struggle for survival for the honey badger. In case of any danger, it digs and hides itself under the ground or inside a tree. Likewise, the small insects that emerge when it digs are seen as one of its biggest nutrients. You might think that if he digs so well, he must build his own nest. But that is not the case at all. Honey badgers invade the nests of other creatures and use them as hotels. It is known that pigs, foxes, and mongooses often invade their nests and sleep in them and feel quite comfortable. The honey badger, which weighs 15 kilos at its heaviest and 75 centimeters at its longest, is such a brave creature despite everything that it has been accepted as the world's most fearless creature in the Guyanus Book of Records. Honey badgers have even been seen attacking predators such as hyenas, lions, leopards, and pythons. The honey badger is an omnivore. This means that he consumes all the food he finds, regardless of meat or grass. But when we say all food, we really mean everything. Mammals, birds, reptiles, larvae, insects, fruits, plants, roots, eggs, carcasses, and more poisonous snakes. Yes, honey badgers are resistant to snake venom. The honey badger has a skin that is exactly six millimeters thick. That is thicker than most animals in the world. Moreover, since this skin is like rubber, the honey badger can move in its skin. For example, he is caught in the jaws of a predator and is helpless. It immediately turns itself around in its skin and gets into a position to attack the predator. When the predator takes an attack position in its jaw, its powerful claws and extraordinary teeth come into play. The honey badger's teeth are so strong that they can easily break even a turtle's shell. The honey badger walks alone, sleeps alone, hunts alone, eats alone, and generally dies alone. 